to your thing, it's, a, it's creating an emotionally compelling taste and appetite for beauty. It's yeah. joy. We have to live in a joy. I mean, the culture is not a joyful culture. It's a stressed out, unhappy, angry, freak out culture. So what if I, I think, you know, like there's this, like my buddy Mark Sayers always says that the move of the spirit is to zig when culture is zagging, <laughs> right? So right now the culture is going toward noise and anxiety and outrage. What if the church, which has some you know, responsibility in the justice issues, a lot of it actually, but were to go towards silence and peace and like true deep work of healing. So we're talking about like starting a Quaker early morning service before a regular service where we do like half an hour of silence mm. and we do like, you know what I mean? Like almost contemplative practice. And I think the church needs to become like a place for noise refugees where people come yeah. and experience silence and beauty and peace and their phone is gone. And you know what I mean? And they're in a thick web of community. Yeah. So all that to well, say, beautiful. those are the type of things we're dreaming well, about. Thank you.